All right, in this video, you're gonna learn how to do a double kettlebell squat. Now, prerequisite is gonna be that clean into a goblet squat. If you don't have those, you need to start there first and learn these movements. I'm gonna start on a box. I'm gonna use a little bit lighter weight because I'm gonna be talking throughout this. So, set up with the bell, hand length, of, uh, arm length away from you. We're gonna go into a hinge, so you wanna have a kettlebell swing or a double kettlebell swing for this and you wanna know how to do a double kettlebell rack. If you don't have any of those movements, this probably won't go, won't go as well as you'd like. So from here, hinge. The bells are gonna be pronated grips, so I'm gonna grab there, and I wanna make sure that they're not in the pinky side. I have my grip in more the neutral to thumb side. We're gonna tilt the bells, shift my weight back. I don't want my weight in the balls of my feet. Now from here, we're gonna hike the bell. When I hike, my thumbs will turn in. I'm gonna snap and then redirect the bells, pulling them in. They're not gonna fly away from me. I'm gonna tame the arc, um, so I don't wanna curl the bells up, which is pretty common. I want to snap, pull, punch, and arrive in that rack position. Now, once we get into the rack position, a couple things. Uh, number one is, this is an option. Um, gentlemen, I typically will recommend that they either be in a rack position neutral or they allow the knuckles to come together and the elbows can go slightly apart but not flying away from you. We want to keep the lats engaged here. Women, we generally recommend that we don't rest the heavy weights on breasts, so we like to keep them open in a neutral position. From here, we're going to go into our squat. Or position two. Squat. Notice I gave a grunt on the second one. I did not on the first. Both are good options. The second one will allow me to create more stiffness um, or tension or stability at the bottom of the squat. Let's look at that from the side. And that is gonna be the double kettlebell squat, which, requ which requires a kettlebell clean to get it into the right position. Give that a try. 